House of Delegates has passed a bill to commemorate the Richmond Planet newspaper with a specially designed license plate, the historic paper known for reporting injustices against the African American community. 8 News reporter Rachel Keller has more on what this means and how family members of the paper's editor are reacting. Rachel. Hello, good evening, Deanna and Eric. Well, this license plate has been in the works since early last year. The man behind everything and the idea says that he hopes to bring attention to the newspaper's legacy and honor black history. A bill to commemorate the Richmond Planet in a license plate passing unanimously in the House shortly after it passed in the Senate. Reginald Carter started the push more than a year ago. It's a surreal experience, so, you know, to me, I'm definitely grateful. In the 1800s, Richmond Planet editor John Mitchell Jr. fearlessly reported lynchings and injustices against the black community. The bill backed by Senator Joe Morrissey, Jennifer McClellan, and Delegate Jeff Bourne. The only word was hallelujah. John Mitchell Jr. is great, great nephew John Mitchell found out about the initiative on social media. I immediately got on a group text and let all my cousins know uh, we keep each other in, you know, involved with anything that has to do with the family. It doesn't matter what, but this was a big deal. Carter had been researching a Tappahannock lynching, coming across an article from the Richmond Planet and became inspired. I just decided to tell their story in an innovative and creative way. With a design change, the new plate features a flexed bicep and the words dream for purpose and black is 365. It's all inclusive for any and everyone that celebrates black excellence. The plate will be presented to the DMV before it could potentially hit the roads. Now, the last step is for Governor Yunkin to sign. We've reached out to Senator Jennifer McClellan's office, and the governor is expected to sign, we're told, and this should take effect on July 1st. Live in Richmond, Rachel Keller, 8 News. Thank you.